here, your wellness strategist and nutrition evangelist, still in India, last night here. And so today I'm talking about, hey, when is it okay to cry uncle? When is it okay to just stop pushing through? Um, it's been a busy week and a half for me here. There's been sightseeing, there's been meetings, there's been a seemingly endless string of Indian buffets. And honestly, I'm, I'm ready to go home. I'm ready to sleep in my own bed. Um, I'm ready to have my local fresh fruits and vegetables that I miss. You know, I'm ready for all the things. Um, and, and obviously I'm not cutting my trip short. I'm not thrown in the towel, but I wanted to talk about that concept today because sometimes we're pushed to an all or nothing mentality. If you're trying a new lifestyle, you want to get healthy, you want to create a gym habit, you feel like a failure if you can't do it all, all at once. And so I want to talk about that for a couple of minutes with you and let you know that it's okay to not be able to do everything all at once from the first second you try to do something. It may take a couple of tries. Maybe you do just a little bit more each time. We call that the 1% rule. Um, and before you know it, you'll be so much further along than you were before. And sometimes you're gonna look at a new activity and say, you know what? It turns out this really wasn't for me. And that's okay too, as long as you're being honest with yourself. And it's, it's truly not for you. It, maybe you need a break from it. That's okay too. Just be honest with yourself. Take the next steps accordingly and find something else to do, to eat, to do for relaxation. Don't just, don't just do nothing, right? Because doing nothing's rarely a good solution unless you're, you know, Sunday afternoon in the hammock with a good book, then by all means, do nothing. Um, but so I want to just talk about the uh, culture of pushing and pushing and pushing forward. Um, I was supposed to meet up with some folks this evening and honestly, it's been a long day and I'm tired and I'm going to call it an evening early. I'm going to sit and read my book. I'm going to get packed to head to the airport tomorrow. And that's, that's pretty much it. Um, so next time you see me, I will be back in the Boston area. Uh, I'll be back at my own desk. Um, I'll be back doing all the things that are part of my normal routine. And I loved being out of my routine for a while. Obviously, there are things to take, I take with me, um, my healthy habits, my water, all the things we've been talking about for the past month. Um, and I've loved trying new things, trying all the new foods and the new flavors and the new spices. Um, it's been great. And so cherish the new things that you've got cherish the familiar things that you have and decide honestly with yourself when it makes sense to add something new and when it makes sense to try something and move on from there. And so with that, I'm always curious what new stuff you're trying. Leave me some, some notes in the comments down below and, and what stuff you're letting go of that may not suit you anymore for whatever reason. Um, that's it for me for this week from India. As always, what I hope for you is that you live a life you love without being hungry, feeling deprived, or giving up the things that bring you joy. Until next week, ciao.